In photometry, luminous intensity is a measure of the wavelength weight of power emitted by a light source in a particular direction per unit solid angle, based on the luminosity function, a standardized model of the sensitivity of the human eye. The SI unit of luminous intensity is the candela, an SI base unit. Photometry deals with the measurement of visible light as perceived by human eyes. The human eye can only see light in the visible spectrum and has different sensitivities to light of different wavelengths within the spectrum. When adapted for bright conditions, the eye is most sensitive to greenish-yellow light at 555 nanometers. Light with the same radiance intensity at other wavelengths has a lower luminous intensity. The curve which measures the response of the human eye to light is a defined standard, known as the luminosity function. This curve, denoted v or, is based on an average of widely differing experimental data from scientists using different measurement techniques. For instance, the measured responses of the eye to violet light varied by a factor of 10. Relationship to other measures Luminous intensity is the perceived power per unit solid angle. If a lamp has a one lumen bulb and the optics of the lamp are set up to focus the light evenly into a one steradian beam, then the beam would have a luminous intensity of one candela. If the optics were changed to concentrate the beam into one half steradian then the source would have a luminous intensity of two candela. The resulting beam is narrower and brighter, though its luminous flux remains unchanged. Luminous intensity is also not the same as the radiance intensity. The corresponding objective physical quantity used in the measurement science of radiometry units, like other SI base units, the candela has an operational definition. It is defined by the description of a physical process that will produce one candela of luminous intensity. By definition, if one constructs a light source that emits monochromatic green light with a frequency of 540 terahertz, and that has a radiance intensity of 1 683 watts per steradian in a given direction, that light source will emit one candela in the specified direction. The frequency of light used in the definition corresponds to a wavelength of 555 nanometers, which is near the peak of the eye's response to light. If the source emitted uniformly in all directions, the total radiant flux would be about 18.40 milliwatts, since there are four pi steradians in a sphere. A typical candle produces very roughly one candela of luminous intensity. Prior to the definition of the candela, a variety of units for luminous intensity were used in various countries. These were typically based on the brightness of the flame from a standard candle of defined composition, or the brightness of an incandescent filament of specific design. One of the best known of these standards was the English standard. Candle power. One candle power was the light produced by a pure spermaceta candle weighing one sixth of a pound and burning at a rate of 120 grains per hour. Germany, Austria, and Scandinavia used the Hefner Kürzer, a unit based on the output of a Hefner lamp. In 1881, Jules Weil proposed the vial as a unit of luminous intensity and it was notable as the first unit of light intensity that did not depend on the properties of a particular lamp. All of these units were superseded by the definition of the candela. Usage The luminous intensity for monochromatic light of a particular wavelength lambda is given by where IV is the luminous intensity in candelas i.e. is the radiance intensity in watts per steradian is the standard luminosity function. If more than one wavelength is present, one must sum or integrate over the spectrum of wavelengths present to get the luminous intensity. Illustration of some photometry units. 